Cynthia Toad, Miss Flip It, your gypsy medicine woman and your happiness coach. And Flip, it, flip and Fills, <laughs> Flip and Fills <laughs> on Instagram and your TV host on Your Hidden Love Story. That's right here on this YouTube channel on Monday nights at 9.30 Pacific Standard Time. Come join in for some fun. You get, to get in the chat and ask some questions. The masculine, the masculine's going, which way to go, which way to go? Can you just show me which way to go? I'm going to check out my map, and I'm going to put out my thumb, and I'm going to, let's see, see if it will show me which way to go, which way to go. Can you just tell me which way to go? <laughs> let's see. Go towards the magic. <laughs> which way to go? Go towards the magic. You have all the tools. You have all the skills. way to go you have everything that you need in whichever direction you go in whatever direction you go <laughs> whatever direction you go you have everything that you need you can go towards love, you can go, go towards work, go towards love, go towards love, work will come. You'll always do your work. <laughs> Let's see what the cards have to say though. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, you know that there's someone out there you love, you go towards it. Well, what if they don't come towards you? I don't know. Let's see. <laughs> it says, be strong. You have tamed that lion. So you're strong, you're courageous. You don't have to roar so hard anymore because the lion is right by your side. <sighs> giving you stability, giving you strength, giving you love. He's licking her hand, that's why I said he's giving her love. <laughs> and the kitty cat, the, the black cat's watching. Going, Aww. She, there's a tornado back here that she's gone through. All those tower moments, all that things that, you know, swarm around and go around. She's gotten strong and at peace through all of that. Staying calm. Staying whole. Staying complete. Staying courageous. Keep doing things that others are afraid to do. <laughs> Tower moment. <laughs> I have never read this card as you know going through you know a tornado <laughs> and that tower moment. So you can go. I I will make it through this tower moment. I don't care what tower moment comes. I'll still make it. She's grinning. She's smirking. Another one. Uh, go bite the dust. <laughs> Another one. Go bite the dust. There's, I don't know. There's a song that I'm trying to think of. Know that you have your thoughts in order. They're crystal clear. That you, you have. This is a feminine. The feminine has gone through some tower moments. So, the masculine is trying to figure out which way to go, and the feminine is going. The feminine has all the tools to do whatever it is that she has to do. She has a lion by her side, and she's had to go through some tornado movements. But she's calm. She's peaceful. She's strong. She's courageous. And she's getting some love from the lion. <laughs> she's getting some love from the lion. Woohoo! As she's going through these tower moments, the tower moments of, you know, those old ways of thinking, those old ways of, you know, believing that something isn't good enough or something can't work out. Going through that tower moment, it's like she's still smirking. It's like you can't, you can't hide this underlying feeling of love. <laughs> That's crystal clear. She's crystal clear with that. She's operating from a loving source. 
She's got a feather in her hand like she's getting ready to write something. I wonder what that next card's going to be. What's she going to write? Is she going to write a letter? <laughs> Is she going to write <laughs> the love story? <laughs> she's going to keep writing the love story because these lovers belong together. Look at it. They even look like they belong together. Even the cats are there. They even got a heart in their tail. Because they're full of love. They both made it through those tower moments. That's the story. That's the story this queen is writing with that feather. She keeps writing that story I love. No matter how many tower moments she's gone through. No matter how many tornadoes come through. <laughs> He's like, we're going after the love story. That's it. We're just going to keep going after the love story because it is the best story to go for. Yeah, the masculine still has a few things to be working on. I got a couple more thoughts. And I want to get out of the picture. I want them to be swept away. Let me hurry up and get rid of them. Get rid of those thoughts. You gotta do it swiftly. Because the love is right there. <laughs> You've got to He's trying to hurry up and get rid of some of those last moment uh, last thoughts that are in there that keep tripping this story up. The the ones that bring these tower moments in that the feminine is going, is that all you got? <laughs> You know, you're standing by my side. You can throw me all your tornadoes and all your tower moments you want and tell me, oh my goodness, how this isn't going to work. But the feminist, she's crystal clear about this love story. Allowing, giving, granting time for the masculine to take care of those final thoughts because they are to work together as a team. He sees the magic in her. He sees that she has something beautiful to create. And even um, his team, friends and family, they all support what the feminine has to offer. And it is about the happy ever after story. Having it all. Having the love. Having the castle. Having all the food that you ever wanted, whatever clothing you want to wear, whatever clothing you want to wear, you're well taken care of. And you're in love. We got love in the picture, for sure, for sure. The feminine is holding her balance in peace, content, why she's on her own waiting for this love story to piece itself together while the masculine is crafting and putting the story together let me rebuild it this way i got a little bit more color to add to it here i got a little bit more color to add to it there as she waits in bliss and peace knowing that everything she's done she's earned Everything she's done, she's worked for. Everything that she's done, she's at peace with, content with. And she knows how to spend time on her own in that peaceful way. But she's really after this celebration. Waiting for the time to celebrate. Celebrate this happy ever after story where we got the castle and all the friends or family are there and they're celebrating because this union finally came together. Even the kitty cats are there celebrating with them. Where's my dog? My dog must be in the castle. <laughs> so we got the lovers, we got the ten of pentacles, and the four wands. <laughs> And, and the Ten of Cups. Yes. The, the love story where the two of you are looking each other in each other's eyes. So much in love with what you found with each other. It's like, did we really do this? Did we actually get to meet up and get to spend our lives together? 
in this peaceful, blissful, romantic way, I could just stare you down. <laughs> I could stare you in your eyes all day and all night long. Because there's a magical love story going on here. Union is coming in. He's crafting the final details here. As she waits in peace and in comfort. As she waits in bliss and in ease. For this fairy tale dream of a story to come forward. Because there's gifts and talents to work and be. There's just a few final thoughts that need to be taken care of for this love, for these lovers to come together in this magical, beautiful way. <clears throat> magical, beautiful way. Ten of Cups, Ten of Pentacles, Four of Wands, The Lovers. <laughs> yeah, that's what the highest priest sees in her crystal ball. It says, yep, that's what I have to show you. <laughs> the end of the deck. <laughs> where to go? Where to go? The beginning of the deck. Which way? Which way? It doesn't matter which way you go. Because the love is already there. It's already in the picture. It's already being crafted. You can go either which way. And you're going to come out okay. You are the queen of pentacles. Feeling confident. Feeling whole. Feeling complete. Feeling well taken care of because you are. Feeling grounded. Feeling loved. Feeling whole. What's underneath that? Three of Cups celebrating. Friends and family celebrating. As you keep moving forward, sharing your gifts with the collective out there, young and old, you're sharing this bright light out to the world while you're waiting for this balance to come in. To have this happy ever after story come forward. Sun is the happiest card in the deck. Happy, happy. <laughs> Radiant, playful, joyful, exciting, passion, play. Nurturing. Uh, sunny. Radiant. Bright. Colorful. That's what our life is supposed to be, right? So I'm going to close the reading here because we're going to close on a positive note because that's what I know how to do because I want to leave you in a higher vibrational way by flipping your story around to a better story. <laughs> Until next time, this is Cynthia Tellant, Miss Flippy, your gypsy medicine woman and your happiness coach. Please remember to like and share and subscribe and on Monday nights come to this channel and watch your hidden love story at 930 Pacific Standard Time and you can join in on the chat, ask me questions as I go through. Um, I do half an hour of my talk show and then I do about an hour, hour and a half of readings for the collective or for answers or I meant for people that are typing in the chat and wanting um, personal assistance <laughs> because we're going to flip that story around to a better story because we want you to be living your life today. <laughs> All right, till next time. Bye-bye.